Good evening. My name is Gary Lake, L-A-K-E. Um, I'm a past councilman for the Cutter Tribe, or Karoff, or Karoff. I'm not sure how they pronounce it anymore, but uh, and also uh, a vice, past vice chairman of the Shasta people. And uh, I believe in 1827, the Klamath Lake um, Indian guide that was for the, the uh, Peter Skeen Ogden party that was camped near what's presently known as uh, J.C. Boyle Dam, uh, their Indian guy told his party members that no salmon came past that point, which is presently uh, that dam, the location of the John C. Boyle Dam. This is historical fact. The Klamath River is a reverse watershed and is historically warm. While many cold water rivers might benefit from dam removal, the Klamath River will not. Let it be known, I was a councilman for the Karak tribe. And we were approached, repeatedly approached, the council by the Department of Natural Resources, Craig Tucker's good friend Lee Hillman, and um, basically we were told that we could turn the coho salmon into the new spotted owl. And we could run the white man, the miners, and the shastas off the Klamath River and steal back the land. Political correctness. You guys talk about all these other tribes, but you never mention the Shasta people. 50% of the entire Klamath River is within the Shasta territory. And that's a fact. All the, the dams that are slated for removal are within Shasta territory. The Shasta territory will be split between two interloping tribes, the Karuk, Karak or whatever, and the Klamath, and it will basically exterminate the Shastas. If you look at all the stuff that the Cutter Tribe and everybody else are posting, they never mention anything about the Shasta people. It's Karuk this, Karuk that, they're the territory, everything. The bottom line is they're socioeconomically exterminating us, and, and you are part of that. And you will, you know, eventually have to deal with that, of course, uh, as truth be told and history is told. Um, you know, I, I could say a bunch of other things, but the bottom line is this. There's, you know, there's Mount Shasta, there's Shasta Lake, there's Shasta City, there's Shasta River, there's no Mount Karuk, there's Shasta Cola, there's no Mount, you know, there's no, there's no Karuk Cola, there's no, you know, they, they are a supplement to Treaty Q, and we all know it, they're not a Treaty R tribe, and they are being allowed to basically, with you, your guys' help, exterminate the Shasta people. And uh, that's, you know, that's about what I have to say. You have to really think about that in the future because you as well as everybody else will be held accountable. Thank you. Thank you.